Okay, so last video I did, did videos on the drone. Um, this video we're going to do photos. So we'll start out with all the way zoomed out. You're looking at the screen of the drone now. Take a picture here. And there it comes out with a visual image, a thermal image. So we're going to do the second one now. We're going to switch to thermal mode. And we're going to snap a picture. This one gives us a visual and a thermal on the memory card on the drone. So now we're going to switch to split screen view and take a photo like this. And this gives us a visual image, a thermal image, and guess what? A split screen image on the drone's memory card. So we have those. Now what if we zoom in? So we're gonna start out with visual and yes, that continues to pop up even after you update. Um, so all the way in, visual, I'm going to move this around a little bit so we can see some of the text on my neighbor's vehicle. This is about 100 feet away from the back of where I'm, I'm taking the photos with the drone. So we'll get a couple different font sizes on here. And that looks pretty good. We'll snap a picture here. What? No zoom. That's kind of strange. No zoom on the thermal. Okay, well, let's switch this over now to thermal. And we'll zoom all the way back in. It's 16 times now. Free use was 32 in a picture. No zoom. No zoom on the thermal. Okay, let's go to split screen now. And we'll zoom all the way into 16 times and take a picture and see what happens here. No zoom. No zoom. But the split screen has zoom. Okay, so this is where it gets really weird. So here's three photos. On the left, we have the visual photo with no zoom. In the center, we use the split screen method to take the picture with 16 times zoom. And on the right, we have split, and I selected the split photo as the final one. And the right-hand one is the best for some reason. They're different. So here's my mean mug here. Uh, the mailbox back there is about 60 feet back. So the final image split looks like this up close versus the regular full frame image that's not zoomed at all. And so your quality looks best if you select the saved split screen photo and zoom on it for some reason. I don't understand it, but uh, DJI has done some weird stuff on how it saves the photos. So if you're doing any type of zooming, with the camera, make sure that your screen is on split screen mode on the controller when you take the photo and it will yield the highest quality image on the drone's actual memory card.